All right, hey guys, welcome back to another Marvel Legendary video. So, with two days to go left from a side complex, they dropped another preview, so I figured we'd go over it. So, as of seeing this video, as of today, it's January 17th, that means it's coming out in two days. I won't have my copy of it probably till Friday or Saturday, um, but I don't come back in town until Saturday anyway, so I wouldn't, that'd be the earliest I could do the unboxing of it anyway. However, I figured let's go over this stuff and then... Hopefully in about a week or so, we can look at the actual whole set. But Legendary Messiah Complex, Special Psychics, and Unveiling, sub, excuse me, something new for schemes. So, um, it says, we know how much longtime players love sidekicks, so we finally found a way to bring them back. That's right, you heard correctly. A new group of sidekicks are making their triumphant return to Legendary in the new Messiah Complex Deluxe Expansion. So we have Special Psychics X students. Um, let's see. This set comes with new special sidekick, sidekicks, X-Men students, X-Force recruits, and members of X-Factor. When, when you set up, shuffle them face down into a sidekick stack. And then once per turn, you can pay two recruits to recruit a sidekick from the top of the stack. When you play any sidekick, return to the bottom of the stack. And then this just kind of gives some general rules about sidekicks. So when you play, you still played the sidekick, so you can use superpower abilities based on the hero class. However, since it's gone, it's not one of your heroes or a hero you have anymore. When a card says play a sidekick, put it on top of the stack. Oh, sorry. When a card says gain a sidekick, put the top card of the stack into your discard pile. That doesn't count against your uh, recruit one sidekick per turn. And then it just says that Secret Wars Volume 1 and Civil War have sidekicks in them. So here are two of them. We have Rock Slide, who's an X-Men hero. He has Shatter, a villain. So that's his ability. And then we have um, Layla Miller, who's X-Factor. Um, one attack, and then it says choose a team, investigate for a card uh, of that team. And then, of course, they both have put on the bottom of the sidekick stack. So pretty straightforward. Next is about schemes. So basically, it says, I'm going to skip kind of this stuff because whatever. But then it says there's double-sided schemes. Um... Basically, now we have schemes that make it so we won't know how a game may end till the mid-game. How's that for added suspense? Veiled and unveiled schemes. So we have the scheme of mutant kind often hides... Then, I'm sorry, the enemies of mutant kind often hide their true goals until it's too late. All four schemes in this set are veiled schemes and will say unveiled scheme on the reverse side. When you see any of the schemes cards start the veiled side face up, at a certain point it will say... This scheme transforms into a Veiled Scheme. This means you remove this uh, Veiled Scheme from the game and replace it with a randomly selected Unveiled Scheme from all of the ones you own. You might randomly select the reverse side of the Veiled Scheme you might uh, you started with, or you could randomly select an Unveiled Scheme from a different card. Okay, that's going to be crazy. So the first one here is Hack Cerebro Serves Servers 2. So it says 10 Schemes Twists. This is... Uh, uh, twist one through five, put a card from the bystander stack next to the scheme as a hacker, KO a hero from the HQ with cost equal to the number of hackers. If you KO a hero this way, stack this twist next to the mastermind of the stolen Cerebro data. Twist six says put the hackers on the bottom of the bystander stack. The scheme transforms to a random unveiled scheme. Do its twist effect. So this one is con control the mutant messiah. So when revealed, uh, twist stack next to the mastermind or manipulations. Shuffle a random extra hero into a face down mutant messiah stack. Twist, add this twist to the uh, manipulations. Investigate the messiah stack for a card and set it aside. This turn you may gain that card to the top of your deck by spending recruit equal to its cost plus one recruit for each manipulation. If you don't, then put a card into a fallen messiah stack next to the scheme. Evil wins when there are three cards in the fallen messiah stack or the villain deck runs out. This is going to be crazy. So it says, uh, well, that's it for previews for my sign complex. What do you think? Are you excited about the Messiah complex as we are? We feel this expansion will soon become a fan favorite. Messiah complex has something for every fan of legendary, exciting new heroes, truly challenging masterminds, return sidekicks, extremely suspenseful schemes, and more. A lot of hard work went in this one, and we're very proud of what's included. We'll see. Well, we hope you love it too. Okay, this is going to be crazy. This is going to actually be super crazy. And actually, what will be really cool is if we get these, maybe not every time, but like we got transforming schemes in uh, Revelation. So like this is going to be cool. So I'm super excited for this. This 
this is probably the thing I'm most excited about. It's going to be very, very uh, complicated, <laughs> but it'll be a lot of fun. So, okay, so that's going to be it for that. So in a couple days it releases. Uh, as soon as I get my box, we'll do the unboxing and overview. Um, and I've also been doing some research on some other uh, single-player board games or card, deck building games or card games. So I've actually got the definitive edition of Sentinels of the Multiverse coming. Uh, I bought it, so I'm waiting for it to release. So it, I will do an unboxing of that, kind of just going over everything that's in that game. Uh, but if you'd like to see stuff for that game, like videos for that game, I'll definitely do it too because it's superhero themed and it's uh, can be played solo. So anyway, let me know what you guys think so far. Let me know what you guys think about these sidekicks and the schemes. I, the schemes are going to be so cool. Um, but that's going to be it for today. Uh, see you guys tomorrow with a, an Alien playthrough. And uh, then Friday we've got another setup. So I'll see you guys uh, in another video. Bye-bye.